in a few minutes, Chris. All right, we thank you, Chad. Well, COVID-19 rates haven't slowed down in the Fox Valley, and some parents in Appleton worry their kids may never step foot inside of a school. Local Five's Rhonda Fox shows us how these parents are taking action. The reason for the recall is we don't feel as though those board members are bringing forward a voice of the parents and the students in this district. After nearly eight months of virtual learning and no answers, some parents now want to recall three members of the Appleton Area School Board. President Kay Eggert, Vice President Leah Olson, and Treasurer Jim Bowman. We're looking for an option outside of virtual for our children. There is no other option besides virtual at this point in time, and it's not working for all the children. We were disappointed that the board would not listen, that there aren't any open listening sessions, and the one that they did have wasn't terribly open. So we're looking for a voice with the, with the district. That's our primary concern right now. The Appleton Area School District relies on the CDC to determine the appropriate learning model for students. The number of new cases in the last 14 days in the city of Appleton and the Tri-County region have been high, according to the AASD website, so this warrants virtual learning. The rates of uh, COVID are definitely high, and I think surrounding school districts have proved that we can do this in a safe way. It's okay if parents don't feel comfortable with their children going back to an in-person setting. In that case, there is a virtual option. Since there's no vaccine for COVID-19, parents are only left with seemingly unanswerable questions. What if the cases remain at an elevated level higher than what the board's metrics are? Is it okay to have our kids out of school for nine months? Is it okay for a year? In Appleton, Rhonda Fox, Local 5 News. And we reached out to uh, three school board members in question, but have yet to hear a response. All right, news now from across the valley. Kakana police are looking for a vehicle that ran.